Managing Director Kyle Taylor says their system does not have to wait for it to rain and then take water from the ground. They use condensation. He says a staff of 10 is employed at the facility and help with the storing of water in a holding tank and before it is filtered. We're doing this predominantly off-grid. So we have a full PV system that we're running uh, about 90% of our own energy. And then our bottling is in either plant-based bottles that we can compost in 30 days in just the backyard in our, in our farm here, right? Or they can be put into a landfill safe. So there's no plastic in the bottles. They're 100% made out of corn. We also do glass on a delivery return system. So when you take our full product line, we're the only people doing this in the world, making water from air, doing it off grid, and putting it in plant-based bottles. Eco Skywater. Chief Operating Officer Philip Lafleuf says the operating system is akin to a large outdoor dehumidifier and runs on solar power. We basically capture the moisture that would be present in the air. We mineralize it. Um, it goes through UV light for sanitation and then we bottle it. From there now we as Kyle had explained, everything is solar run, so the entire operation is backed up on solar. Uh, from there, we do we package them in the plant-based bottles or glass, which is then delivered using either our electric van or, or other delivery van. Um, generally, it's generally, it's just a very straightforward operation in terms of delivery. Sanitation is high on the company's priority list, and the water company technical official gave details of the plant and the production. This bottle would go on here and it would spritz the bottle with water, with ozone within it to sanitize the bottle right before bottling. So the, it's basically like a, a high pressure spray, it's gonna hit the bottle okay. to wash out if there's any dust or anything within it, but it also has ozone within it to, to sanitize it. Yeah. Then we have a, a fill system, which is just a tiny fill, so you hit the button, it fills all the bottles. With the plant base, we, we cap these by hand, but we, with our glass bottles, we don't have any plastic within the cap. So that's why we have these ROPP machines which actually crimp the cap directly onto the bottle. An automatic bottling system is in the development plans and company officials say they are also looking at franchising. Trevor Thorpe for the Business Report.